Let's take this cab. way. Where to? Yes, can I get two metro passes for the day, please? Yeah, how much to East 96th and Park? Darn things are broken all over the city. Well, why don't you and your friend just hop on over? On the house. Well, my meter's busted, but my wife just called. We're having a baby, so no charge. What? what? Okay, oh so my god, the cab is like having a baby and you're like a baby for free. Let's go. What? That's very convenient. <laughs> <laughs> Almost people. <laughs> and babies. 
<laughs> and besides, I do all my work on it, and there's the internet. A word. Free cell? Paint? <laughs> all that I don't know. Hmm. Oh, at least I did something, right? What? My rent statement. You threw away your rent statement? Uh, well, it sort of got adopted by my landlord, so... What? Take that! The cup? No, the statement! You think so? Yes. Oh. All right. My turn. All right, I'll be there in a second, and Laquisha, tell him to take his pants off and sit on the table. <laughs> thank you, thank you. So, what's that? Do you, you want to hear that song? Jeez, oh, I haven't done that song in so long. I'm not, I'm not prepared. I am prepared. <laughs> Maestro.
What? Was your wow like ew or impressed? <laughs> impressed. Oh. Itself, no. You're right. You need any help? Uh, no, actually. That was fast. <laughs> I'm a big girl, Polly. I know what I want. <laughs> <laughs> that dress? Yes, this dress. Uh, well, you've got other nice ones. Why? Why not them? Well. God. 
Oh, God. Ah, oh, God. Like I said, you're not ready. Why would you ever listen to that? Well, it was a thought I had back when I was overcoming my musical. You see, I just wanted to overcome everything and it just didn't work out. How did your theory work? Well, my theory was to counteract the musical with a really terrible recording of a real show. And when you guys came along, when you guys came along, <clears throat> I decided to give it another try. And, and nothing. All I have is a pile of crappy songs. Big waste of $20 million, if you ask me. <laughs> uh, the idea. Remember when I told you that I took notes towards the end of my musical and went over the rules of the world? Well, I also discovered what made the musical choose someone. A flaw! The person involved has a flaw in them. It's like the world is trying to make itself a better place. It's some um, self-realization. What was your flaw? Fame. Fame? Fame? Fame. What does that mean? Does it mean success? No, it means greed. Me. Did I have fame? Sure. But was I happy or insecure? Well, I was happy. Ha! At least I thought. For that moment, I was on fire. and, uh, of course, your landlord. Wow. Mm -hmm. Now, Paul, I'm going to ask you a very important question. <clears throat> Are you willing to change? Yeah, 
Yes, yes I am. Well then, all you need to do is repeat after me. <clears throat> I, Paul, stand this way on my reality <laughs> that I would change my voice. <clears throat> ah, Paul! <laughs> you must mean it. <laughs> I, Paul, solemnly swear on my reality to change my avoiding way. I need to. <clears throat> now, if it work, if you meant it, it will work. That I knew yours the moment I saw you. May I ask how long you've been dressing like this? A while. I have a whole closet full of costumes and dresses. Aha! Uh -huh. Costumes. That's all they are a mask. Can I ask you what is it about yourself that you do not like? Uh, I don't know. I think people think I'm weird. I may not be perfect, but why are you asking me this? you hide in your clothes? You found these costumes and you found a way to hide yourself. So, this is my own fault? Well... I've been living a year like this because I wear costumes? Well, yes and no. <laughs> no, I like wearing these outfits. They feel right. They make me feel unique. They separate me from the crowd. What about you're so close? But I, I want to be different. You are. But why? I'm sorry, Mr. E. I appreciate your trying. Oh, Beth, come on. You're just so close right now. Yeah, Beth, don't you want to end all this nonsense? Well, no, that's not what I meant. Is that what this is to you? Nonsense? That's what this day has been? I've lived a year like this. I never found anybody to share it with. And you live it a day, and all of a sudden, you're the expert? No. I love you, Paul. Beth, I love you, too. I thought I was nonsense. No, you're not. That's right. I'm just a memory. Because by tomorrow, you'll forget all about me. Uh, if you can't get her to see herself, she'll be stuck in the musical forever. Beth! I know I didn't mean what I said about you being uh, nonsense. Uh, look, uh, from the very beginning, I've loved you. I do love you. And tomorrow, what Mr. E said about forgetting everything. I don't want to forget you. I won't. I may avoid the rest of my life, but I won't avoid you. God, that was corny. <clears throat> look, Beth, if you get this, just please call me Beth. Voice mailbox is full.
name is Beth. Those who 
were nice at the start go back to being rotten <laughs> but forgetting happiness put our consciousness to the test and we made it out all right this is the finale of the show